Hello everyone, how are you doing? I hope everyone's doing having a good day. Um, I got blocked on Twitter by him with Scooby. <laughs> I've never interacted with him in my life. I don't know why he did that. I follow all the other uh, reporters and I don't like the cut of his jib, but he blocked us. I never said anything directly to him. Never interacted with him. So yeah, he blocked us. So I'm devastated. I couldn't sleep last night. I was in so much emotional pain. <laughs> so today I am going to do a reading on Omid Scooby and see what it's like to be the Sussex's mouthpiece. Show me Mr. Scooby. Oh, he's under stress. He's sick. He's not sleeping. It's probably because he blocked me. It's probably heartache. No, this guy is under a lot of stress. He is getting a lot of um, anxiety, not being able to sleep. Uh, he's definitely worried about something. He definitely feels attacked as well. Queen of Wands is what's crossing him. Yeah, this is this is Megan's boy. Queen of Wands is. Uh, da, 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 da. It is a fire sign, fire sign, and Leo, Leo is a fire sign. Megan comes up in the royal readings as Queen of Wands. Again, this is somebody who likes to see themselves as um, um, a leader, creative. Um, they're very tactile. They can be quite vain. And all of these things have negatives and positives. And that's the kind of Queen of Wands energy. Seven of Swords. What is known about the situation? Well, everyone knows with the Seven of Swords that this is the kind of like trickery. And this is where people are um, teller of tall tales. They're not actually being very straight with you. And then we have the Queen of Swords underneath it. Is this... We keep getting the Queen of Swords in reverse when I'm doing Harry and Meghan and all of that kind of reading. I wonder if they're getting some advice. There's somebody behind the scenes who is very kind of driven and bitchy and a little bit more drama -y. And they're definitely giving it a bit more go get them. I wonder who the Queen of Swords is. Nine of Wands, okay. So, this guy talks a good talk, but he hasn't necessarily felt supported by them. Um, there has been some um, breaking down of boundaries. So he may have been well getting phone calls in the middle of the night and uh, he could well have been getting emails and told off a bit and told what to do and how to phrase things. And yeah, it's not easy. King of Pentacles in reverse. Ten of Cups. Nine of Pentacles, okay. Two of Swords. And Knight of Wands. Mm. So, the Ten of Cups is... It's quite a positive card. It often is... Um, a big focus on family it has the rainbow on it in the traditional tarot it can be quite superficial it can be like um creating when it's in reverse aspect it's creating um an illusion of a happy family creating an illusion of um things being a little bit forced when we have the nine of pentacles this is shown as a very prosperous woman in a garden um, very queenly and this is an earth sign 
and I'm going to go with um, they're going to come out and say stuff against Kate Kate's Earth, Kate's Capricorn they don't see her as a queen it's really weird it's almost like when you're reading for Kate, when you're reading for the royal family, when you're reading for anything to do with Harry and Harry's kind of side of things, they don't see Kate. They look down their noses on Kate and that comes out in the cards. We've got the Two of Swords here. He's going to make a tough decision and he might be getting markled because we've got the King of Pentacles in reverse there. And I'm wondering if he's if his relationship is going to break down with um with harry and then you've got the knight of wands there which goes with um somebody who's a little bit more fiery somebody who's um quite quick tempered They've got a good kind of brain for um, weighing up risks and going with it. And they've got a good gut instinct. Not as in a psychic kind of instinct, but maybe like an instinct for business and instinct for people. So that's interesting. But we've got the King of Pentacles there in reverse. I think he's going to come across, he might come across Harry. Interesting. I'm going to do some, pull some cards and see what, if. How's Omid's and Megan's relationship? four of wands okay this came up before when i was doing a reading on harry and this is somebody who is poof, bow down at my king's feet at my queen's feet here um they do have a good relationship it seems but what crosses them he's vital to the team at the minute the hermit okay in reverse harry and omid don't get on that well Fool in reverse, okay. The sun in reverse. Cruelty, nine of swords. Hmm. Let's just, I'm just going to do the rest of the cards and then. Queen of swords in reverse, that came out again. Prince of Wands, Knight of Wands, Prince of Wands. There we go. Some of the cards match. Balance, Two of Swords. Wow. There's the Two of Swords again. Okay. We get a lot of repeating cards. Seven of Wands, Challenge. So... There is a little bit of um, bitching and fighting that goes on there. The relationship is quite negative. They are quite um, bitchy, quite feisty. Um, we've got the judgment card there. He's, there was What is surrounding the relationship is some big um, changes. You've got the nine of swords there, which is cruelty. So they've bonded over some, um, maybe some, I don't know, something. Um, the sun there is the children are underneath the relationship and the fool under, in reverse means they've had a false start recently. He's feeling and he's scared of being judged. With the Seven of Wands there in the future. 
there is going to be a quite a bit more fighting there will be a time where he does have to decide i do think he is going to get markle within a year or so um harry's not happy with him Hmm. Yeah. I think he's going to get markled. I don't I think there's going to be pressure on um actually coming from Harry to get rid of him. And why I think that is the two of swords came up in both energy picking up and the um And the um, <clears throat> do, 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 do. Knight of Pentacles. Where is it? Let me get it up. And there's an awful lot of swords. So, yeah. Let me know what you think. Thank you very much for coming and joining me for this reading. Um... Please like, subscribe and share and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.